This is your next amateur radio go bag, just introduced by Gable Radio with design influence from me, Bob, KD4BMG HOA Ham. From the custom embroidered logo to the color offerings of olive drab green or desert tan, it becomes very obvious quickly that Gable Radio spared no attention to detail on appearance and quality, but perhaps the greatest feature is adaptability and expandability. Those who've watched the channel for any length of time know I'm one of those people. I'll put a bag within a bag. I like to protect my gear. I like to be organized. I don't want to admit how many go bags I've purchased throughout my ham career. Sometimes I'm in a minimalist mood. I get the smallest bag possible. I want to contain everything, take the fewest pieces of gear and still be able to operate. And before long, I start adding this and adding that. And before you know it, I have to get a larger bag. And so I go between this extreme of a small bag that just doesn't quite do it and a large bag that is much bigger than I want to be toting on the back of my back and my shoulder. So here's the interesting thing about this Gable bag. It will expand with you. You wanna be a minimalist? Go ahead and be a minimalist. Just grab that center pouch. And in that center pouch, here we have the ability to just house our antennas only. These would be the size of antennas that are similar to the Gable 7350T and TC. And if you wanna get a little bit larger, just fill up one of the other compartments. And because every one of these comes out with Velcro, you have the ultimate flexibility to make this bag as small as you want or as large as you want. So there's no need to keep buying more bags to fit the mood of the month. Get this bag and it will grow or shrink with you depending on how you're trying to operate, what gear you're trying to load up, or how you're rolling this month with your minimalist tendencies. When I think go bag, I think fully contained, fully functional with everything that's in a modestly sized bag. None of these pouches are bursting at the seams, but I have everything I need to operate. A BD7 maple ground spike, a short run of coax. Here I have an antenna analyzer, as well as a really small UHF VHF HT. We've already seen the antenna bag in the middle. Here we have a short run of uh, three 16 and a half foot radials, and here in the final pouch we have a bio and a battery and a radio that's no stranger to the channel my fx4 cr so if you have any similarly sized radios this is easily a self-contained pack for you the gable website describes these colors as khaki and army green i'm going to call them desert tan and olive drab green they either have one handle or two depending on how you want to roll up the bag so you have that versatility the second handle is a padded handle and then we have a shoulder carry strap here that connects to the d-rings if you want to carry this crossbody or over top of your shoulder I've already mentioned it's six individual pouches. Use them however you want. They easily detach with the Velcro straps. You can pull them all off, put back on specifically what you're needing for the day for the event. Put one small bag on, one large bag, just the antenna pouch. However you need to roll for the specific event you're operating for that day. In addition to the two handles, we have two grommets, two D-rings, and on the bottom side, a large vinyl pouch accessible via zipper. Hiding under the six individual pouches are three elastic straps. Remember the bag is about 15 inches deep, so anything you put in larger than that would overhang just a bit. While my FX4CR would never travel in a bag like this without some additional protection, I just put it in there so you could see, in fact, it was contained in that pouch, along with what you should all be asking, does the G-Gable Radio MK3 tripod travel in this go bag? It absolutely does with ease. And not only the tripod, but all four of the adapter posts can fit in this go bag with the radio kit. If you can stick with me for two more minutes, I want to give you my complete thought on whether or not this is worth your time and investment. A couple of weeks ago, somebody sent me a question about a Gable product, and they said, because you're Mr. Gable, I thought I would ask you. They were being facetious. I'm not Mr. Gable. I don't have any ownership in the Taiwan company that produces some of this pretty awesome gear for us. I also don't review everything that's on the Gable website. Honestly, some of it's Me Too gear, meaning you can go buy it elsewhere. 
They have products that are similar or exact to what many other distributors have. But there's some product that G Gable Radio offers that's differentiated. There is no tripod out there. In my opinion, that's as versatile as this MK3 tripod. This 7350T or TC antenna system to me is incredibly amazing how small, lightweight, and capable it is. This is differentiated gear. My opinion on this antenna radio go bag, it's differentiated. For the price, the value you're getting is pretty incredible. So while I don't review everything that's on the Gable Radio website, the things that I think are of high value or that are of great interest to me, I'm going to talk about them. This is pretty impressive. That's what I think about this new go bag. I hope you found this useful. I'll talk to you soon, friends. 73.